Hey, what's going on, guys? So if you guys didn't hear already, Tom Brady wants Odell Beckham Jr. to join the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Man, I mean, first of all, they franchise tagged Chris Godwin. Dude's coming back. We're going to have our whole wide receiver core back. The linebackers, I know that Devin White and Levante David are back. Not sure about Shaq Barrett. Also not sure about uh, Indama Kong Su. We'll figure that stuff out. But now we're going to be talking about Odell Beckham Jr. possibly coming on to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. This is just, this is out of hand. Tom Brady, man, all he asked for was a small say. He just asked for a few weapons when he was in New England. So he comes to Tampa Bay where they have a plethora of weapons. And then he brings in Rob Gronkowski and Leonard Fournette and Antonio Brown. And then they form this entire like Avengers team with Tom Brady as Captain America, Gronk as Hulk, and then Scotty Miller as Ant-Man and all these guys, you know, just a bunch of receivers all coming together as one with Mike Evans, Chris Godwin, and just so on and so forth. You guys, I don't even need to tell you, even Tyler Johnson, the, the rookie who came in, made some clutch catches in the playoffs. It's awesome. Personally, I'm not going to sit here and say, hey, man, I was on the Chris Godwin boat all the way through. I actually was not. I was saying we get rid of Chris Godwin, bring in a veteran guy like Julian Edelman to really balance out the, the locker room and to, you know, Julian Edelman and Tom Brady have that connection. So no matter what happens out there in the field, he always has that guy to go to. So that was my plan for it all. But then now it's turning out to be a little bit different. Now we're seeing guys like Odell Beckham Jr. interested. So the whole idea behind this is that Tom Brady just wants to show that he has power and that he can do whatever he wants. So he's basically just going out there and saying, hey, it's kind of like the AAU teams, man. He's just going out like, oh, I want him, 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 him. He's taking all, all these guys and they're just there. And it's awesome, man. As, as a Tom Brady fan, I'm just, out, I'm just out here having fun, just enjoying it all. But if we can land Odell Beckham Jr., that is game. Seal it. I already think it's game. I think the Bucks are going to go to the Super Bowl with the Chargers. And I think the Bucks are going to win. But, you know, it's going to be crazy this season especially. It's going to be awesome. I think it's going to be wild. Prescott is on the Cowboys again. So we'll see, man. He says that he's going to take them to the Super Bowl. I have no clue what's going to happen, but if OBJ signs with the Bucks, I will come back on here and, wow, dude, I don't even know what to do anymore. What's next? Are we going to get Julio Jones? You know, at this point, it's just like, you know, we're going to get anybody. A anybody we want is going to come to the Bucks. It's crazy. It's like, you know, win a ring, the retirement place, no state tax, great weather. Like, come on, man. Like, if you're playing, like, Green Bay and you're, like, a Wisconsin dude, you're playing there and you're shoveling snow and you see Tom Brady throwing the trophy to another boat during in, like, January, dude. It's just not, dude. Like, that's just unfair. The greatest advantage ever. I think it's awesome for the Bucks, but for the rest of the league, hey, sorry, man. You hate us because you ain't us, <laughs> all right? Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow in the new video. Bye.